What's the difference between a hurricane and a tornado? I'm storm shoot meteorologist Jason Myers, and they are both a testament to Mother Nature's fury. They both spin counterclockwise in the northern hemisphere, and they both cause loss of life and property each and every year, but they are far from the same thing. For one, they both form in very different ways. Hurricanes form in warm ocean waters. Moisture evaporates, rises, and begins to circulate. As the storm grows, winds continue to speed up, and eventually an eye forms around the middle. Tornadoes, on the other hand, spawn from thunderstorms. Rotation in different layers of the atmosphere within a thunderstorm create a funnel cloud that eventually reaches the ground. But neither one of these is necessarily more superior than the other. Difficult to compare, but something we can compare? Size. Hurricanes can be hundreds of miles in diameter. The biggest tornado ever recorded had a damage path of a little more than two and a half miles, but most are only three to 400 yards. In fact, tornadoes have been known to spawn inside a hurricane. Advantage, hurricane. Now round two, what about wind speed? Hurricanes may be bigger, but tornadoes still pack a punch for their size. Hurricane force winds range from 74 miles an hour for a weak storm all the way up to 157 miles an hour or more for a catastrophic Category 5. A weak tornado starts out with winds around 40 miles an hour, but an EF5 tornado has winds anywhere between 261 to 318 miles an hour, much stronger than the strongest hurricane force winds. Point goes to tornadoes. Tie ball game. Next round, what does more damage? Tornadoes do all their damage using those extremely strong rotating winds. Hurricanes, however, come with a triple threat. They use strong winds, heavy rains, and storm surge, bringing huge waves crashing on shore, causing more flooding. But even so, tornado and hurricane activity can vary from year to year, but study after study has shown that on average, they're both equally damaging and deadly. This one is a draw. But what lasts longer has the endurance, the staying power, the stamina. Hurricanes last for a few hours to a few weeks and the average falls somewhere in between. Tornadoes are on the ground anywhere between a few seconds to maybe a few hours for an especially strong storm, but the average is somewhere between 2 and 15 minutes. Hurricanes can go the distance. Tornadoes and hurricanes vary on warning time as well. Since hurricanes take so long to form and do a lot of traveling before reaching land, people usually have plenty of notice to take cover or evacuate. Watches are typically issued two days ahead of time and warnings are issued 36 hours before anything happens. Tornadoes are completely different. Watches are sometimes issued an hour or two ahead of time and the average warning time for a tornado is 13 minutes just enough time to get to a safe place. Tornadoes are definitely scarier for this reason alone. And now we've ended up with a tie, so it's settled. Don't mess with either of these storms. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment below, and subscribe to the channel.